You saw recently the whole Balenciaga scandal. Yep. What do you think about that? I know. Well, I can tell you what I think about it. It's very obvious they're trying to tell the world they're pedophilic. They're trying to tell the world. Would you? Would you agree? <laughs> would you I, agree? I mean, definitely. Gonna, uh, go on. Sorry. I mean, it was definitely like a very controversial thing, but like how did they get that wrong isn't that bad for their brand i i'm i'm gonna try and pin you down and make you say it are they trying to tell the world they're pedophilic yes or no i don't know. i honestly the, don't know honestly you i don't do know, know. I don't why know. are you scared to say <laughs> this is the problem everyone's afraid yeah, I mean, to say definitely, it that's what it shows but the thing is i wasn't sure like okay this is what i was thinking could it be possibly okay look obviously i'm totally against what i saw as well okay um but like when they were saying that you know they didn't see it like because there's different teams handling oh, yeah of course um, yeah. and sometimes you do realize like okay we like we do, we have our own like company as well but like sometimes like we just by looking away for a second sometimes the people just do their own this thing. was not like, one this was not one photo shoot or one advertising campaign that yeah. happened to have one thing in it which could be misconstrued this is yeah. every single different advertising campaign across different film shoots by different companies all having multiple references to pedophilia pedophilia so it wasn't just, a mistake no so how could it be a mistake what's the statistical odds of that being a mistake it is obviously on purpose are they trying to tell you they're pedophilic yes or no i mean Pay, pay the, pay the, just say yes this is the exact <laughs> problem with the world the exact I mean, problem with the world is that people who are sitting here with influence are afraid to have a firm opinion on anything because they're scared of being cancelled balenciaga just got cancelled they can't come for you balenciaga please ain't gonna bust in here don't worry i'm here yeah. if they come in i'll deal with them it's fine i'll take them out you can say right now that they're trying to tell you they're pedophilic because they are they did it on purpose they've done it across multiple different advertising campaigns with multiple hints per advertising campaign, yeah. trying to show you they're pedophilic. And the fact that you guys will still sit here and go, no, no, mm, I'm not we sure. We agree on that. Is, is that they're, a, a they're, they're, say yes. they're pedophiles. Say Balenciaga <laughs> a pedophile. <laughs> say it. Say I, the word. Balenciaga, no, you I'm are not, a I very bad know. person. <laughs> they're, they're, no, they are. And they're doing it on purpose because they're satanic. They're trying to apps, they're trying to destroy the baseline morality inside of humans because once you do that, the slave programming has no resistance. Even things that you know intrinsically are wrong, like pedophilia, for example. Yeah. You know it's intrinsically wrong, but they're deliberately trying to attack your senses and make you sit and question yourself and go, well, maybe it's not so wrong. If they can convince you that having sex with children who have no consent to give is somehow acceptable, then they can convince you of anything. They can convince you to kill your fellow man, convince you to lock yourself in your house because of the common cold, convince you to work a job for no money, own nothing and be happy and eat the bugs. It's bullshit. Yeah. And they're doing it on purpose and they're attacking our senses. And it's extremely important we call them out and make it clear that we know what they're doing and we're not stupid enough to fall for it. You guys cannot be afraid yeah, no, to sit here and say look, the we're, truth. We're against that 100%. But you have to that. say it no, clearly. But it's just that, you know, and sometimes we just wonder, like, re like, what was the reason? Like, was it really on Because purpose? they're satanic. Was of course it, it was purpose? on purpose. You know, that's the thing. That's always been a question because, like, sometimes I've seen, like, working with a lot of people can be super hard. So, obviously, look, I, I don't know what the logistics of the whole company was, but obviously I'm totally upset to see what happened as well. You don't accidentally include port papers from child pornography yeah, that, cases that in shocking. multiple yeah. photo shoots yeah. you don't accidentally include references to yeah. ball a god which ate children in multiple photo shoots you don't accidentally include works of art that show children naked dancing around fires in multiple photo shoots you don't accidentally put bondage gear with children yeah. on accident across multiple photo shoots the, the ads the odds of that being a statistical accident you're better off you can win the lottery that's ridiculous it was on purpose, completely satanic. They did it specifically, and they did it to show you and tell you what they're doing. One, because they're trying to assault your senses, and two, because if you actually understand the truth of Satanism, most people don't know this about the world. If you understand how Satanists work and think, Satanists believe in karm karmic retribution. They don't believe they're allowed to trick you. If you believe in Satan, if you worship Satan, if you're a Satanist, you believe it's important you tell people what you're gonna do because then you will not pay the price. There'll be no karmic retribution for your actions. So let me give you an example. If I sell poison apples yeah. and I put up a sign saying apples and you buy one yeah. and you die, then you were poisoned. If I sell poison apples and I put up a sign saying poison apples and then you buy one and you die, you committed suicide. Uh -huh. The fact that I told you what it was means I'm not guilty. I didn't murder you, yeah. you committed suicide. Okay. So when you do bad things, when you do evil things, the Satanist handbook, you can look this up yourself, yeah. the satanic religion says, you have to make it clear to them what you're doing. And if they don't resist, 
If they don't stand up against it, then they are complicit. They're agreeing that what's happening is okay. So by telling you they're pedophiles and nobody do anything about it, they could sit there and go, well, everyone knew we're pedophiles. Look, it's obvious we're pedophiles yeah. and nobody cares, which is also why it's so important we call them out. You can't sit here and be wishy-washy on some issues. You have to sit here and say, this is disgusting. These are children. They're being exploited. Balenciaga are pedophiles. It should be canceled absolutely with certain language. Both of you have very large pro profiles and platforms. But, say it. To say the fact. Uh, Balenciaga are pe uh, pedophiles. <laughs> be after me. Balenciaga are pedophiles. Yo, but Why what about... Okay, Why will no one yeah, say yeah, it? Okay, What's people, the fear? The people who did that are pedophiles. I Balenciaga are pedophiles. Fuck Balenciaga. They can come in the door right now. There's not a single person who works for Balenciaga I couldn't rip their head off their do shoulders. You, do you believe, okay, uh, in uh, number one second chances, but also that cancel culture because a lot of people yeah, okay, okay, said, here, for example, here. Andrew Tate is a misogynist.